The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE United States Championship. Hello and welcome to my WWE 2K20 match simulation, as you just heard, of the United States Championship match that is coming our way tonight on the Payback pay-per-view. And yes, I know this arena is Backlash, but WWE 2K20 is booty, and when you download a Payback arena, or any arena for that matter, excuse me, it, uh, it just makes everything brilliant bright white and has no um logos or editing done to it whatsoever so i had to just make do with a backlash i mean i figured backlash and payback are similar concepts both got the word back in you know we're, we're pretty pretty similar events so we'll just go with that uh so the challenger coming to the ring accompanied only by shelton benjamin because mvp isn't in this game uh <laughs> um is bobby lashley who will be accompanied by MVP in the real uh, pay-per-view match and Shelton Benjamin, I believe. Wouldn't it be good if uh, they did some sort of segment where MVP gets taken out by Apollo Crews or something and uh, or taken to one side by Cedric to discuss joining the Hurt Business as a bit of a decoy or something. So he does end up not at ringside. And the game is psychic. If that ends up happening, come, come on over back here and make sure you comment on that. And how psychic the game is. Anyway, let's get the champion out here. With his old music, which was amazing. I miss this music. With the old belt as well. I like the old belt as well, to be honest. But I like the new belt. I don't mind that. Don't mind the new belt at all. The new United States Championship. Let me know in the comments which is your favourite... United States Championship design. There's this one that was around forever. There's the new one. There's the old WCW NWA one. Like, let me know. Also, let me know who you think is going to win this match. See if uh, you agree with 2K20. If you want my predictions, by the way, they're going to be going up on WWE Baser. Uh, so check the description. That will have the links to all my other channels, including WWE Baser. So once you're done with this video, and once you're done watching match alongs in general, you can... Uh, Head over and check out my predictions. So, let's get the introduction done. We're doing it like it's a main event, apparently. And then let's get this show on the road. There's the flag, there's the belt. And here's the introductions. Introducing the challenger from Colorado Springs, Colorado. Weighing in at 273 pounds, the almighty Bobby Lashley. And introducing the champion from Stone Mountain, Georgia, weighing in at 241 pounds. He is the WWE United States Champion, Apollo Crews. Was it even really like a pause then when he, he didn't even pause a breath after introducing Bobby Lashley he just jumped straight introducing Apollo so champion hands over the belt definitely shows the uh, the championship to Bobby Lashley and just stares straight past him vacant look on his face at Apollo Crews ref looks more hyped up for this than Lashley here we go now he's getting hyped his eyes don't tell that story but at least he's jumping around a bit Apollo checks his knee pads and we go Oh, Lashley went straight out of the gate for a right hand, but Apollo picked him up. Oh, Death Valley driver right out the gate, and then a kick to the back. Shelton felt that one, but Lashley dodges the stomp, and then they tie up. Apollo Crews through into the arm ringer. Now, Lashley reverses that into a top wrist lock. Great technical wrestling by these two. Hammer lock by Apollo Crews. Back and forth they go. Now, Lashley goes through into a hammer lock. Great reversal, great technical wrestling by these two technically sound athletes. And then Lashley strikes to the back and pushes Apollo off. But right jab by Apollo. Oh, and a swinging neck breaker squared. Like he's swung more than he has to. And then a boot to the face of Lashley as he was up on one knee. Now strikes to the inside of the knee of Lashley and now goes for the pin. Hooks the leg that he just attacked to try and prevent the kick out but gets a zero count. 
And Apollo can't quite believe it for some reason. You really think that's enough to put away the Almighty? I don't think so. They tie up. Lashley pushes Apollo off. And then Irish whips him towards Shelton Benjamin. Shelton doesn't get involved though. Spinebuster. Really elevated Spinebuster by Bobby Lashley. Went for the kick to the gut, but Apollo caught it. Uh-oh. Picks him up into a power bomb. Great reversal. Two very powerful, very technically proficient athletes here. And now Apollo taking a moment to pose as he's made Lashley retreat out of the ring. Lashley back in, though. Doesn't appreciate that elbow on top of the head. Oh, nice back body drop. Or back drop suplex, I guess. Oh. Headbutt to the back of the head of Apollo flattens him. Oh, went for the overhand right. Apollo blocked it. Punch to the gut and gets back to his feet. Overhead belly to belly suplex. And Lashley once again retreats. And Apollo once again poses. Lashley only gone to the apron this time though. Not all the way out of the ring. Oh, throws a forearm and comes back in. Grabs that front face lock. Snap there, take over. Oh, goes down into a side headlock. Trying to wear down Cruz now. But Cruz fights out of it. Up into a standing headlock of his own. But then chooses to release. Was that a bad move? No, he's got him up. Another Death Valley driver by Apollo Crews. Now strike into the shoulder, trying to take away the power game of Lashley. They both have great power game, but Lashley might just have the edge in power. So, good tactics from Apollo. But there's where Apollo comes through. Look at that beautiful drop kick. Athleticism. Bobby Lashley is a freak athlete, but he ain't going to touch Apollo Crews for agility. Then again, look at Apollo showing off his strength. Deadlift gut wrench suplex. And another drop kick. He can do it all, this man. Lifts Lashley up. Right hand. Feynman's carry takeover as Lashley tries to retort. Now, what's he getting in mind here? Oh, hammerlock. Oh, Lashley not technically fighting his way out this time. Instead, hits a back elbow and a reverse STO. But Apollo dodges the stomp. Lashley retains control though, snap there, take over, and now a nerve hold. Not every day you see that in uh, in these this day and age. Not going to win a submission over Apollo with, with that, but it weakens him somewhat. Oh, back elbow right on the nose, then a forearm to follow it up. And now look, that's what I was talking about, that strength. Gorilla press, power slam by Bobby Lashley. Incredible power. Apollo Cruz is no small man. Goes for the pin. One. Two. And Apollo kicks out at two. Lashley straight back on the offense though. Not dwelling on that. Oh. Apollo fights him off. Hits him in the ribs. And a leaping Enziguri to the side of the head. Goes for the pin. He thinks he caught him clean there. Might have knocked him out. Two. No. Lashley kicks out. Apollo in shock. So much so that he couldn't move both hands to his head at the same time. Oh, he went for the kick to the gut, but Apollo, uh, Bobby Lashley back in control, sorry. Leans Apollo against the ropes. Uh-oh. Close lines him out of the ring. Uh-oh. What? What's Bobby Lashley going to do here? No way. Oh, my God. He just clean jumped over the top rope and took out Apollo Crews on the outside. Where did Lashley get that from? No wonder he's feeling pumped. The freeze count up to two. Oh, forearm by Lashley. Can't win the title out here, but he can do some damage. Double underhook overhead belly to belly suplex. Oh, Apollo fires Lashley into the apron though, but only briefly regains control. Lashley fights him off, hits a clothesline. The freeze count up to five. Champion's advantage is with Apollo here. Lashley, you're going to want to put him back in the ring here. Oh! He bounces his head off the ring post for extra damage. He's going to want to put him back in the ring though. Referee's up to seven. He's warning them. Oh, Apollo fires Lashley across. Is he going to take the count out of victory? He's showing off for the crowd. He's like, I got one over on him. N oh, he went out to try and break the count but didn't get there in time. Controversial. Apollo didn't want to take the count out win, but the referee counted it all the same. Shouldn't have taunted. Wow. 
So Apollo retains by count out. That will not be the end of the issue with Bobby Lashley if that's how it goes at Payback tonight. Let me know in the comments if that's what you think will happen. If not, what do you think will happen? Don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you're new here and share with your friends if you think they would enjoy. Also check the description for my other channels, my social media and my Patreon where you can support me for just one US dollar per calendar month and it'd be greatly appreciated. But for now, all I have left to say is thank you very much for watching. As always, I've been Abaser, you've been amazing, and I will see you next time.